Hello everyone, it's Kesh back here again with the Lay Pro 3. Like I said, I was gonna give my own my other reviews about this video. I've already said it in the first video, I really like this phone, everything works perfectly and smooth. I've gotten some other apps on the phone. Remember, I bought the phone for 153 pounds, so that's really good. Only 153 pounds, that's how much I paid on it because it was on the discount. And at the moment, I think it's still on the discount, so you still can get it for the same price. I bought it from, bought it from Banggood, and it took about um, 16 days to get to me, 16, 17 days to get me to me. But anyways, I've got it now, and I've started using the phone. I've been using it for about a week now. And I really like the phone, everything work, works perfectly, it's simple, no headphone jack, not the end of the world because I love everything about the phone anyways. It has IR blaster, I never use it but it's good to know it's there. Everything feels nice and premium. So yeah, it's very good, the headphone jack work, works really quick. But then I have noticed some issues. Main issue is with notifications. So I bought the phone from Banggood, yes, and I'm using it in UK. It doesn't really support so many regions because for example um, this wallpaper app look at what happens when I click it wallpaper app is not supported for current region which um, it's not really the best of things to happen but not the end of the world because I really like to change it the, <clears throat> the wallpaper but then what I re figured out what I think happened is so it's simple it doesn't have any lay TV app so many like it doesn't have those lay apps it has my lay uh, i'm gonna try and focus so it has the my lay eco option there but it doesn't have like if you if you watch other youtube videos you should see like this normally it's quite different but then what i noticed is that i think the seller must have um, because this is an international version they must have um rooted the phone and that's why it's this simple and has less unimportant stuff but at the same time it stops some apps like the wallpaper app from working and i can't use fingerprint app attached to my natwes banking accounts because it's been rooted so yeah so for some apps that might be a problem but it's still not an issue to me because like i said all i wanted was a very simple phone that does everything that i want and this does so yeah and then all the notification is and the other problem I mean is the notification issue like I said with WhatsApp and Snapchat sometimes you get a message the notification doesn't come on on the app doesn't come on here you don't get any notification until you actually open the app that's the only time notifications go I haven't got any messages here but it does it really it, oh oh okay it worked now I just got two notifications as I open the app there we go you see that's literally a live problem oh and that's even a message from yesterday I've already opened this one by the way I've already opened that message but I don't know why it's just coming in now like I said sometimes it just doesn't come until you open the app and the same with WhatsApp as well so I'm gonna open the WhatsApp oh uh, there we go ah so easy look at look at when the notification came I got this when when does it say yesterday and the phone only just beeped so that's one of the problems that I noticed with the app and then look at the notifications coming up here I mean for me I just feel like it allows me not to use the app every single time like stay on my phone every single time but then at the same time I'm having a conversation and I leave it for about an hour before I return I'm like oh my god someone messaged me and then I go and check so it's a really 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 terrible issue the fact that you can't you don't get notifications every time and yeah so some people i mean a lot of people will find that as a problem i mean you don't get notifications i mean that's one of the um main reasons why i don't know for downloading the app you just want notification you see how all the notifications have just popped up now meanwhile i got them a while ago even the google one only just came up now so yeah that happens i feel it's because it kills the app really quick like the ram management i don't know how it does it but it does that really quick but then if you see out of the four gig of ram that's available two gigs but yeah it still queues up the apps really quick but besides that there is no other problem i've noticed but if i notice any other issue i will let you know but for now that will be all of it so I'll catch you guys in the next one bye